Bob Swanson founded the American Legion Riders here in the state of Nebraska. The members here say he truly will be missed. I've known Bob Swanson for about 13 years. Brian Mann is the state liaison for the American Legion Riders. Wednesday, he saw the news about Bob. I saw it the night before and they didn't have a name and I got out of a meeting and I saw it and it just floored me. And it floored a lot, of, it floored all of us. And um, several of us went to his house to be with his wife and his two daughters and other friends. Mann says it's hard losing a friend who has done so much for the community. He just always had good ideas about things to do for our veterans, whether it was down tune on the ears of our legislators or whether it was uh, raising $15,000 for the flagpole up in Pilger, you know, that was destroyed by the tornado a couple of years ago. He's a character. Um, he will make you smile. He's always got some wisecrack. Um, one thing about Bob Swanson, it only takes one conversation for you to know that you got a friend for life with him. The American Legion riders are providing an escort to their fallen brother as a last goodbye. We're all going to be on our motorcycles. You're going to hear all the rumbling of the motors. And I'm sure we're all going to be thinking about, we sure would like to just be on a ride today with Bob. Services for Bob Swanson start tomorrow at 10 a.m. at the Embassy Suites La Vista. We post some more information on our website, KETV.com. Reporting in Omaha, Alex Lisi, KETV Newswatch 7. And again, the riders will gather tomorrow morning at 8 at Post 32 in Papillion. They're planning to be at John A. Gentleman Mortuary by 845. Then at 9, they will escort Swanson's body to Embassy Suites in La Vista for his memorial. There will be a luncheon afterwards at American Legion Post 1 from 1 till 3.